Okay, in this eighth question, I am given that ABC and BD are two equilateral triangles such that D is the midpoint of BC. So, if I consider this is my ABC, then D is the midpoint of BC and BD is another equilateral triangle. Okay, so now I have to find the ratio of these triangles ABC and BD. I know that all equilateral triangles are similar to each other. That is, triangle ABC is similar to triangle BDE. Why? Because uh, in every equilateral triangle, all the angles are equal to 60 degrees. So, by AAA criterion, I can tell that all equilateral triangles are similar to each other. Okay? So, now I got ABC is similar to BDE. So, uh, what will be the ratio of area of ABC to the area of BD that will be the square of ratio of the sides so I can write it as square of BC is to BD square correct huh? because ok here if I write it as BCA since it is equilateral triangle uh, I can take any side of this one and, I, and any side of this one so it is equal to BC by BD square right so now D is the midpoint of BC what does that mean that means that BD is equal to half of BC or BC by BD is equal to 2 so this is equal to 2 square which is 4 by 4 or I can also write it as 4 is to 1 therefore my answer is C similarly in the next question the sides of two similar triangles are in the ratio 4 is to 9. So, the areas of these triangles will be in the ratio. Area, ratio of areas will be uh, square of ratio of sides, right? That is, area of triangle 1 to area of triangle 2 will be equal to side of triangle 1 the ratio of side of triangle 1 to side of triangle 2 square so what am I given sides are in the ratio 4 is to 9 this means that this is equal to 4 by 9 square which is 16 by 81 so the answer is D you can use this property only if the two triangles are similar so please be careful about this thing so if it is given that the triangles are similar then the answer is 